Hey, welcome to my channel. Well, we're going to do a little testing of a new drone today. This is called the XS812, and I think it's called the Vizio. I don't know. You'll probably see it below the screen. I'm writing the name down there because I'm probably pronouncing it incorrectly. This is one of those beginner drones, something you would buy for someone who wants to get into drones. This one actually has GPS and compass calibration return to home, point of interest, follow me. And it's got a flight range of 200 meters and it flies for 14 minutes. You're probably wondering, you wanna check it out, right? Here it is right here. The trees behind me are kind of swaying because it is windy out. So we'll see how it does in the wind. But before we go fly this little baby as I go get it set up, in the meantime, watch my super quick, super, super quick unboxing. Interesting on the box, they call it private eyes. Let's just open it up and see what's inside. Inside we see the drone and what looks to be like two slots here for maybe two more batteries. This one only comes with the one battery in the drone. So let's just unfold this. It's got a nice gold color to it. Looking at the features, we see it has brush motors. In the front, we have our camera and it is movable. You can go down or up. You have to do that by yourself. On off switch right here, which is nice. Battery location in the back. Here's the battery here. It's a 3.8 volt, 1800 milliamp battery, which is pretty good. That means it'll give you a lot of flight time. And it's a nice system with the battery just sliding into the back. Batteries in the back. Let's weigh the drone. 200 grams. Included in the box is four prop guards, four spare propellers, USB charging cable, Phillips screwdriver, cell phone connector for your controller, and finally the controller itself. And all the buttons are nicely labeled. You can tell exactly what they do just by looking at the buttons. And it takes four AA batteries, not included. Drone powers on like this. So it says just rotate three times. Once, twice, three times, then hold it up. Once, twice, three times. Well, let's see how much drift it does with the wind out here. Okay, that's impressive. Those are brush motors and it's fighting the wind no problem. So that's pretty impressive. It's using the GPS to stay perfectly still. Okay, now I'm impressed. And uh, we'll send it up. Send it forward. See, I've got the camera pushed so far forward that I got the props in the screen. All right, so now that it's looking at me, it's got a little thing here called follow me. Let's hit that see what it does let's see if it literally follows me it actually went backwards when I went follow me so I'm moving this way can you come backwards and follow me this way oh there it is now it's coming so if I move way out here are you gonna come to me it's a little slow on the uptake it likes to keep a really far distance I don't know why maybe because it keeps the wide angle view but it does follow you so bonus for that the follow me works and unlike some drones it looks like if I walk towards it, yeah, it flies backwards. So this has the reverse follow me as well. Okay, that's good. All right, it's got another feature on here. I don't know what's gonna happen. Right here, it's called orbit mode. If I just hit this, what happens? Goes up and it's going forward over me. Oh, so it knows that's where I am. Now what's it gonna do? Are you gonna orbit me? So all orbit mode did was brought it over me. Now it's turning. And it's going the other way. Do I have to do something? Let's see if I have to do something. Do I have to do something to make it go around? I have no idea. Ah, yes, I had to do something. Okay, so there you go. <laughs> I had to push the controls to, to get it to start. So I just move it to the right and it goes around and I can move it down an orbit and I can move it up. So I'm in there, I can put it back up. It will just keep orbiting. What else do we have on here? So we did that, all those buttons are done. It's got a uh, point of interest mode. Let's try that. Point of interest. Let me just show you what I see on my screen. I see a map of where I'm standing right now. So I'm gonna zoom in to that blue dot. So I've zoomed in, I'm gonna hit the little icon on the right, which is a pen. And I guess I'm just going to make a waypoint. I really don't know what I'm doing. I've made six waypoints on the screen. Uh, how do I start it now? Let's try this up arrow. That must be an upload it. Try that. Oh, there we go. It's going up in the sky. So, oh, it's going to my waypoints now. So it's moving to each of my waypoints on the screen. It's going to go to waypoint one. I could have put waypoint one in the trees. I really don't know. I just started tapping waypoints. I think I might have. Is that going to the trees? 
don't go to the trees. I think I put waypoint one in the trees. Okay, <laughs> we gotta bring it back. All right, so the waypoints do work, but you really need a satellite view because I screwed that up. All right, so I got it all way up in the air. Now there's a button on my little controller that says return to home, hitting return to home. It's flying this way. It might be right where I'm standing. I, get, I, I have no idea. It's just zooming around. Where are you coming down? It might think I'm the home. It's moving over. Well, actually, my little home point's over there. So is it going to come down? Is it coming down? It's sitting over top. Here it comes down now. There's no sensors on the bottom, so it, it can't look at the landing point. I guess that's all it does. No, it does land. Okay, I thought it just came out back. It just sat there. But no, it, it landed itself. I didn't touch anything. So that's pretty good. It does fly for like 13 or 14 minutes. I do like the fact it's got GPS because it's breezy right now. And uh, this is doing quite well. Got a little kid playing soccer over there. I'm gonna go, not over him, but I'm gonna go so you can check him out on the field. Oh, now, I don't know what that sound is. Oh, that's a sound telling me that, <laughs> That's the sound telling me that I'm low on power. So what's it gonna do? I'm low on power. Let's see what happens if I turn off the controller. This is probably dangerous. Don't try this at home, kids. I'm turning off the controller. It's up in the air. Am I gonna lose my drone? It's got no signal. Oh no, what's happened? There's no signal. There's nothing is working. It's going up in the air. Did I just lose my drone? No, it's gotta come back and no signal. This thing's turned off. Well, it looks like it went into return to home, which is perfect for such drones. So if you get this drone for a beginner, that's a good feature because they can't lose it. If their controller runs out of power or the drone runs out of power, it's just gonna come home as it gets low in power and uh, fly back. There we are, coming down nicely. All right, drone, do your thing. Come down nicely. Coming down, coming down. It doesn't seem like it's, it is affected by the wind, but it really holds its own. You know, for having brush motors, it's doing quite well. It's so thin, it's so thin along the body compared to what it is. Now, what are you doing? Where are you gonna go hit? Whoa! All right, so that concludes my review of this here drone. Now I'm gonna put the link to where you can get this drone in the description below. Once again, I'm gonna say for a drone that has brush motors in the wind, it's pretty windy right now. We're looking at 20 kilometer winds right now. So I'll put below what that is in miles per hour. And this thing flew and it stayed stable with the GPS with no problem. Definitely a beginner drone. I don't know what the price is or what the coupons are, but uh, check the description below. Maybe there is a coupon. Maybe the price is really good. I have no idea. All right, so thanks for checking out this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more drone videos like this, well then subscribe to my channel because there's plenty more on the way. So until next time, take care.